Hello everyone, this is Sam from Datic Studios. In this short video, I want to talk about preserve UV in edit poly mode. I already created a plane and applied texture to that. Now convert it to editable poly. In edit geometry rollout, as you see, there is an option named preserve UVs. Of course, there is settings for that too, which in this video, I won't cover it. If I select vertex and start moving this vertex, as you see, your texture deformed. The reason is your geometry surface moved or better to say deformed, but your UV map is still remained in the same place. What does it mean? If I apply unwrap UVW modifier and open UV editor, as you see, your UV map here didn't change at all. So your geometry shape deformed, but your UV map didn't change at all. So I undo these changes. And when I'm selecting something like vertex, if I check preserve UV this time and start moving again, as you see, your geometry surface deformed, but your UV preserved in exact same position. I apply unwrap UVW modifier again and open UV editor. As you see, this time your UV map transformed exactly like your geometry. That's the main difference between preserving UV or not. Also, you could do this exactly but in opposite technique. What does it mean? I mean, you could hold your geometry surface fix. Allow me to bring that texture map in edit UVs too. This time, I could, for example, hold my geometry surface shape constant, but move the UV. This is what exactly happening opposite process we done before. So simply, I just recommend you if you want to deform your geometry before do any changes just make sure your preserve UV enabled and now start transforming this also apply for extension or any other transformation like scale allow me to scale the whole geometry as you see, your UV map preserved perfectly. But if I uncheck preserve UV, this time your texture map also will stretch with your geometry. That's it. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please press like button and subscribe for more videos.